Mm-hmm. Uh, we do have more content. Traffic, do not. Uh, oh. Sit the fuck down uh, is running into Daddy. VUA Again, versus Daddy. Oh, they're going yeah, for yeah. round two. Round two. Mm-hmm. And when uh, we come back, we'll actually maybe we'll talk about patch two instead of the PSAs. Yeah. All right. Let's jump back into the ZVZ action on Sit the Fuck Down. Um, as let's see if Daddy can make a change here. Because it was pretty rough for their first round. I'll, I'll say that. But, you know, they came back is all I'm saying. And uh, that's all you really want from Daddy, right? It's just exactly. Please come back. From the store. Yeah. We would hope so. Uh, but it looks like Daddy have gained control of the higher ground here and the choke point. A um, couple rats scouring the back lines here, trying to get involved in the action as well. Mm. Uh, just was a little bit of interruption here for VUA, but sit the fuck down. Doesn't want to play that choke point. He's like, yeah, I, I see the cliff and I really don't want to play it. Uh, and this is something I think will come down to experience of shock caller uh, here. VUA versus daddy is sit the fuck down knows what he wants to do. He wants to play on his terms and he's not right. going to play on the enemy's terms. And this is maybe something where daddy fail at because they're not really that active we don't see them out that much well we see them um, occasionally so they're, they're I mean, we're... like kind of forced to fight into vua's position yeah they're not they're not as experienced as just for fun for sure um but they're they're out and about regularly that and we i mean we see them every week you know it's not like we see them every day but we don't see many groups every day we see vua every day uh, mm-hmm. but daddy we see every week i mean they're regulars on the show Remember That's true. your mom, dad, daddy, mummy, and yeah, and, yeah. and yeah, the other one as well. Uh, but you know, the back and forth continues. Daddy's trying to pull them back to the choke point. VUA is trying to pull them down out of the choke point. So a back and forth continues here. Um, looking at the mini map as well, that's a very disgusting choke point to push. That cliff is extremely long. Um, so it's literally just one one side one push um but so the fuck down is dragging daddy all the way east out into the open just a little bit here we do have like a a cliff style here but it's it's no real choke point and a wasted locust that could be a big opening here for vua are they going to utilize it bedrock mace is already coming out knocking back the attacking forces to sit the fuck down in vua and here we go full engagement Get shut down instantly on the northwest side. Daddy naturally clumped here. Sit the fuck down. He wants to go in. He wants it. Wasted locusts as well. Base scale mage robes coming out. The knockbacks are real here. Sit the fuck down. Can't do anything. He needs a night helm on him. Stat. <laughs> oh, big oh, there it is. Doom I don't think Daddy is coming night. back after that. Nope, and VUA should just steamroll oh. up this choke point right now. They cannot allow Daddy to reset. It looks like they're going to potentially take control of the choke. Yes, they do. They already have tanks up there. And that forces Daddy out into the open again. And Great Arcane on the eastern side will line up, sit the fuck down. It's air compress. Gets shut down himself here. Chain CC's coming out left, right, and center. But here it comes. Good defensives down by Daddy on that round. Oh, please. They need oh, some. They, they need some defensives. <sighs> you secure one or two kills on the return engagement as well. Daddy trying to get back up onto that choke point again, dude. It's like, it's like this fight relies on it for Daddy here. That choke point is where they want to go. I'm gonna get up it once again. I'm gonna leave some of their tanks and uh, melee DP- DPS to die though. Roll. Front to back engagements here for, for VUA, or they're just going to drag these guys down. The fuck down was doing a little bit of diddy dancing, trying to tell his men that he wants to give up this choke point. Yeah, look at this. You saw that little wiggle. That little mm-hmm. wiggle. It's all you need. It, that That's that's literally the indication right there of what Sit the fuck down wanted his men to do. And that was to, to give up the choke point. 
Here we go. Engagement's coming in once again. Defenses are coming down left, right, and center. Sylvian getting utilized. Second clump coming in. Daddy going to lose one. And they're back up that choke point once again. They need to take advantage of everything they can. And uh, avoid that natural clumping that they were doing. They need to be faster with their defenses and supports. They need practice. This is what they need. This right here. Friendly fights. Where they can come back from the store. Quickly. Are what they need. Yep. As long as they're VOD reviewing at the end of it, it's all well. It's it's all good. If they're not, they're wasting their money right now. Indeed. Somebody needs to VOD review. Maybe not the whole group, but you know. No, the whoever. whole group. Yeah. You got to do it as a whole group. You can't do a VOD uh, yeah. review uh, with like two or three people. It's got to be the full, full call squad that out. took call part them in all the out. fight. All right, all right. Everyone's got to gotta see what people did right, what they did wrong. It's a learning experience for everybody, not just a select few. And that's where some guilds do definitely go wrong, is they don't have mandatory VOD reviews at the end. And they allow people to leave the CTA without seeing uh, the positives and the negatives of the fight. Um, and that's uh, how Zerg's become extremely good. And we know that from confidentiality uh, on the West server. Um, you know, those guys, mandatory VOD reviews, and they are now one of the best Zergs on the West server at the moment. Coming up from Arch level about two or three seasons ago uh, to being one of the best now. Um, mm. But yeah, it all comes down to VOD reviews. Even the and, best of the best still VOD review every And how you VOD review, fight. too. You, like, uh, you got a VOD review well. Just watching the fight isn't going to do it and going, ooh, look at that good clump. Yep. You, you, you gotta learn to see what is important for you to review. Like, what's leading to your mistakes? Where are the mistakes being made? How is your composition reacting? How are you flowing? You know, it, I, I almost feel like it's good to have in like, a, you know, somebody recording with the map zoomed in just so you can look at where you, you know, your, your dots and how they're, they're moving around. I think that's very helpful for VOD reviews. But there's so much you can do if you take advantage of the tools that are here. That is correct. But here we go. The breakthrough has begun and the brawl is ensuing. And look at this. Daddy insta flips to the eastern side. Sit the fuck down though. He's going to be lined up ready to rumble. Massive defensive and ring coming down. And that's going to stop. Sit the fuck down. Pumping out that air compress on that choke point. Daddy's going to be able to break down. But it's a front-to-back engagement. Defensive Locust was down, though, and that was a great defensive Locust there from Daddy. Tanks are still up inside of EUA, and Daddy's looking to push the choke point here, but the Sylvian comes down. Both sides, great defensive so far. And that Bedrock Mace once again. Someone get this boy a Night Helm or a Guard Rune on these choke points. Please. <laughs> what are you going to do about it? What are you going to do? He's Tell not the only one. Need. Somebody else could have one, Robin. It's not all on him. I know, but yeah, exactly. Someone needs to put a guard room down on the choke point so they can pass through. And look at this devastating engagement. Daddy striking, but the UA strike back. Good defensive enematic staff there, but the pressure's getting applied. Cooldowns will be up for Daddy first here. And if they can keep VUA clumped like this, that bedrock makes it again. Crying out loud. Oh dear. Loving it. Loving it. Natural clumping here from Daddy, though, on this eastern side is not great. They need to spread out a little bit more here. Here comes the air compress. Permafrost whiffs, unfortunately, for VUA. And their pressure is getting applied still, nonetheless. Daddy cannot keep kiting. They need to turn and burn. Get rid of some of these tanks and melees inside of them. I'm gonna do a flipperoo. Over to the western side. But yeah, Daddy giving up momentum here in terms of DPS output. Really may have just cost them this fight here. Air compress comes in. It's gonna be a slow, painful death, I think, chosen. <sighs> this is uh it's more of the same. Uh, kind of kiting, getting caught, getting followed up on, and um, I don't know. There's a lot to learn 
from this. What would you say is the big takeaway for you on this one for Daddy? What do you think they need to, to take away from this fight? Positioning themselves better. I mean, the, the amount of times I've saw them natural clump, like they do not take advantage of uh, the terrain that they're fighting in, you know, spread out a bit more. Mm -hmm. um, also, I, I've seen their DPS kind of mis mismash their engages. Like, um, I've seen it a couple times now. They're... There's like two clumps kind of made and DPS aren't hitting just in one spot. They're hitting in two spots, so they're not actually securing any kills. Mm -hmm. um, so they need to, you know, actually, actually focus on what clump they're meant to be hitting. Um, two major issues there for Daddy. For VUA, guard runes and night helms, please. Look at this, what I'm talking about, natural clumping. Look at, oh, look at that. Yep, yep. Yep. And and this you is just allowing yeah. sit the fuck down. To, and, and then they move back place. into another clump too. Like yeah. even after, like you, you see that they, they like regroup into clumps. That's the worst. Uh... And, and, and that's the outcome, you know, all defenses were up here for daddy, but in a brawly back and forth fight, which we've been seeing them do, you know, when they give up the, the choke points, um, you know, positioning is key, and if you're naturally clumping, you're you're literally opening the door uh, for an easy engagement. But back onto the choke points we go. Judy's wasted here, both sides looking to brawl it out, and that base scale armor with the with the firewalls coming out here, big clumps coming out. Daddy going to lose one or two. The counter clump comes in, and, and the DPS just not really connecting here in the back line, starting to get pressured heavily. By those melees, we're seeing those bleeds getting applied. BUA once again, momentum in their favor. Inomatic staff getting wasted here by Daddy. And sit the fuck down. We'll have his air compress up, and this could be could be the blow. And look at the clumping to the western side here. The fuck down's already positioned himself because he thinks that they're gonna walk back up to that choke point again. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, I, I can see why you would. I mean, that's expectation. And there's, Ooh, look at that. There it is. That's, that's, that's the real end, Robin. That's that's it. I don't think yeah, there's GG's anything. Yeah, just got cold. Yep. Yeah, that's a brutal end to a, uh, you know, an educational battle. Yeah. You need that. You need to be educated sometimes. And um, they walked away with an education there. Well, they'll be Indeed. paying for for a little yep. while. Three gears are going to be expensive. Yeah. It is. Yeah, yeah, it is what it is, but You know, well, it it's necessary, you know. Get two, three runs in, you know. Learn from your mistakes. Come back tomorrow. Try to get a real fight that you can win against somebody else. Pull some gear off of them. You know, keep learning. Keep coming back. And, and I think that's most important for anybody to learn is that you're going to have losses. And mm -hmm. it's okay. Indeed. Indeed. Yeah. Completely right. But that's that's definitely it now for the, uh, the ZVZ coverage here. So. I'm you